This video will show you how to create an item set and add items to it. So if you have a bunch of items and you'd like to put them into categories, kind of like folders, based on any attribute of the item, you can create an item set. So we're logged in here to the back end, our staff interface, and over here there are items and item sets. Let's go to item sets. We don't have any item sets, let's create one. Add new item set. And this looks similar to the interface that you use when you add an item, but we're not gonna worry about any of these fields other than a title. And we're gonna call it yarn art patterns. We're gonna put all of our yarn art patterns, patterns in this item set. Item set successfully created. Okay, let's put some items in there. Let's go to our items. And I've got a few yarn art patterns. And I'm going to click on the first one. Um, here is the metadata. This is the item record. And here's the media. And I'm going to edit the item. Here at the top of, uh, you can see over here that we're in the item. So this is the item record. Under values, we have all the things that describe it. Media, we have the image or the object itself. And then the next tab over is item sets. It's not part of any item sets. Let's add it to one. So my item set, I'm logged in as backlog. So all of my item sets are going to be under here. Here's the one I want. Let's click on that and the item set has been added. So let's save. And over here, let's go, let's see our work. It says items successfully updated. So let's go to item sets and then yarn art patterns. We need to view items and here's our one item. And so next what I'm going to do is go back to items and add the rest of these yarn art patterns. And I'll do one more. This is the Hiawatha yarn art pattern. I need to edit the item. I need to go to item sets. My item set is under backlog. Here it is. It says all item sets have been added. And so I'm going to click save. Item successfully updated. So now when I go to item sets, click on my item set and view the items, I can see that I now have two items in my item set. 